Hey everyone, Alec here with Veed, and in this video I'm going to be showing you how you can translate your videos to English. So let's say you're a YouTuber and you're bilingual and you happen to make videos in one language but you want to reach a wider audience so you want to add subtitles in another language so more people can watch your content. Well in this video I'm going to be showing you exactly how to do that and as an example I'm going to be taking a video where I'm talking in French and translating it to English. And with that being said let's get started. So the tool we're going to be using is called Veed so you can either head over to Google and Google Veed which is V-E-E-D and click on the first link. If not, as usual, I'm going to be putting the links in the description down below. So once you're on Veed, if you don't already have an account, you'll be prompted to create a new account for free. And if you do already have an account, we're just going to click on the new project button in the top left. So now we're in Veed's video editor, and this is where we want to upload the video that we want to translate into English. So here, if I click on upload video, I select my video and click on open. And now my video is imported into Veed. So just as an example, if I click play right now, Bonjour tout le monde, j'espère que vous allez bien. Aujourd'hui, je fais cette as you can here I'm talking in French. So to translate my video, all I'm going to do is click on the subtitle tab right here. I'm going to be using Veed's feature, the auto subtitle tool. So if I click on auto subtitles at the top, I need to select the language that I'm talking in. In this video, I'm speaking in French. So I'm just going to type in French. I select French and then click on start. Now, depending on how long your video is, this process can take anywhere between a couple of seconds to a couple of minutes. So now it's just finished. And as we can see, we actually have our subtitles uh, in French. So if I click play from the beginning, Bonjour tout le monde. J'espère que vous allez bien. Aujourd'hui, je fais cette... Now I have my subtitles in French. And now the next step is actually translating these subtitles. So first of all, you want to make sure that all of your text is correct. If I have a look through this, there's no mistakes that I can see. This way, it will be a lot easier for V to translate your subtitles. Now to translate my subtitles, it's pretty straightforward. All I have to do is click on the options tab. And then here we have the translate box. So I want to translate my subtitles into English. You can select a bunch of other languages, but in this video, Video, we're going to be translating our video into English. So if I select English and click on translate, again, V takes anywhere between a couple of seconds to a couple of minutes, depending on how long your video is, to translate your video into English. So as we can see, now it is done. If I click from the beginning, Bonjour tout le monde, j'espère que vous allez bien. Aujourd'hui, je fais cette vidéo pour vous montrer comment traduire les sous-titres. Merci de regarder. Perfect. As we can see, it's translated my subtitles and I'm actually pretty happy with all of these. And the only thing at the end would be the translation between French and English isn't amazing. Instead of please watch, I would put thank you for watching. And it's as simple as that to quickly correct your subtitles in case there is a mistake. All you have to do is click on either of the boxes and just type out your correction. And I do want to mention that potentially this translation is due to the fact that my French isn't the best. Now, once you're happy with your translated video, what you can do is either download your translations as an SRT file, so you can upload it to your YouTube videos, or if you want open captions, you can download your video using the download button in the top right, and this will download your video with the captions hard-coded on the screen. So if you want to do that, you can quickly change the style here. You have a bunch of different presets, or you can change the font, the font size, the font color, things like that. But it's entirely up to you. And then once you're happy, like I said, just click on the download button in the top right, and then your video starts to render. And once it's finished rendering, you can download it. And that is how to translate a video into English online using Veed. If you have any questions, please let me know in the comment section down below. If you enjoyed this video and you found it helpful, please hit the like button. And if you wanna see more videos like this, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. With that being said, thanks for watching and we'll see you in the next video.